Hi there guys, I'm Stevie P. You're watching the MTD Rod Channel. Thank you for watching and subscribing. I appreciate that. Um, I'm just going to quickly talk about food costs. Food costs and fuel costs. They're rising rapidly um, due to weather turbulence and, you know, the uh, stability of the Middle East and production in oil there has decreased quite a bit in the last uh, month or so. And uh, so there's oil shortages, which means, and the U.S. Uh, oil reserve is down, which means prices are going the other way. Uh, my flour costs have gone through the roof. Uh, I make pizza. That affects me. That affects my customers. Now, it's very hard for, for a business to just change their, you know, if you've got phone book menus and stuff like that. It's very hard to just change your prices on the go. Um, so quite often businesses have to eat that. You know, some businesses are able to respond, you know, transportation companies are able to respond by increasing their, uh, their rate prices. But as a food business, it's very hard to do that. As a raw food business, it's different. You can pass that along to the customer. But as a, you know, a completed food company, you know, I'm sending out cooked food to your door, right? We have drivers to pay fuel. We have all our food costs that go up. Dairy goes up every time there's a spike in anything uh, because cows are into everything, I guess. You know, the cheese in Canada is very expensive, so we don't have that same uh, flexibility in prices, say you do in the States, where cheese is a third of the price. Um, still expensive, but a third of the price, so you can, you can play with those prices a little bit more. What do you guys do when prices go up? Do you feed your family different, or do you cut back in other areas? Is there certain recipes that you will find yourself more apt to cook it? Will you change the types of food you eat and types of meals you have for you and your family, or do you cut back elsewhere? I would like to know some of the meals you guys prepare when money's tight. Do you start eating, you know, uh, <laughs> macaroni and cheese and stuff like that, or, or soups, or do you continue to eat well, but instead of buying packaged food, you make it yourself? I would like to know because I know, like me, there's lots of you guys out there who sometimes you have money and sometimes you have less money. And when you have less money, it'd be nice to have healthy foods that you can eat fairly cheap. So, video video responses and comments below. I totally want to hear what you guys do. Especially you people with big families. If you have a big family and just an average income or a low income, I want to know how you feed your people healthy. Because I know with five of us, it can be very expensive to do that sometimes. And I'm just wondering where you guys cut back in order to keep the healthy food rolling at a reasonable price. So, video responses and comments below. Love you guys. Appreciate you guys engaging with me. Um, and have a great day.